Hey guys, Silent CL here. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Masters with me. So, in my last video, if you guys watched it, hopefully you did. <laughs> it's it's basically all about um, the basics of events within Pokemon Masters. Uh, as usual, hopefully you found all the information in that video useful. And of course, right now, today, we are going to do our second scout video. So let's take a look at Lyra's um, scout and hopefully to see something nice out from her Chikorita's stats. So let's load up the game and let's dive into the shop which you can find her scout there. So go to Sing Pass Scout. And of course, let's tap this plus button here and check out Chikorita's stats. Of course, we definitely know that Chika, uh, Chikorita actually evo evolves uh, to Meganium, uh, whichever way you want to pronounce the last evolution form, you know, because apparently uh, people around the world all have different pronunciations for Pokemon names and it's always been an issue uh, pronouncing Pokemon names correctly. So <laughs> I'm gonna go with Meganium for myself because that's how I've been calling it all my life. So, <laughs> alright, let's take a look at the stats uh, for Chikorita. Sadly, we can't see Meganium's um, stats, but that's okay. So, Me Chikorita isn't exactly an offensive Pokemon. Uh, even in the games, you know, Chikorita doesn't... Mm, or rather isn't known for being an offensive Pokemon. So, immediately you can see uh, it has special attack as his best stat. So, um, I guess grass moves that uses the special attack skills, like um, energy ball. If you guys don't know how to read, um, you know, Pokemon moves, that circular thing under the type, yeah, that's basically the attack um, stats, or rather the, the, the type of stat that actually this uh, attack is used for. So that ring looking thing is basically special attack. Now of course that red color, um, I don't know how to explain it but let's 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 see. Um, yeah, Lycan Rock has that stat so let's look at Rock Throw. So if you see that red color thing under the typing, yeah that's basically what you need to see when you want to see that the Pokemon focuses on the attack stat. That's why Lycan Rock has attack as its highest uh, offensive stat. So yeah, so Chikorita uses um, special attack for energy ball is definitely um, using that stat to do damage. Alright, so let's take a look at the skills. So energy ball does use two energy. That's kind of a bummer. Uh, has a very small chance of lowering the target's special defense, which is pretty good because um, Chikurita does damage by special attack, then of course you look at your opponent's special defense to calculate the damage output. So yeah, uh, if you guys have been playing Pokemon games competitively, you'll probably be familiarized with all these um, stats uh, and of course um, how the attacks play towards your opponent's Pokemon and of course to yourself as well. Um, for those who are brand new to this and you've been playing Pokemon Go, you are definitely not um, experienced with all of this, but it's never too late to learn <laughs> because that's what these videos are all for. So yeah, uh, so Chikorita has a weakness uh, for fire, so it is not weak to ice, uh, which is basically what um, plant types are weak to generically, so fire and ice, um, well there are other things like bug as well, so I don't know. Um, so they've kind of watered down all the weaknesses um, to each of the typings, which is pretty easy I guess for people who are coming into Pokemon brand new. Uh, yeah, so you just need to pay attention to the uh, weakness types uh, which makes things a lot easier because you only have to memorize one weakness type for each of your three trainers that you bring into your team. Alright so sunny side up. Uh, it's not an egg 
So, <laughs> yeah. Raises the attack. Wait, what? Raises the attack, special attack, and speed of all allied sync pairs. Wow. Okay, so immediately this skill makes Chikorita very, very useful because it boosts all ally sync pairs. So it, do it doesn't just boost Chikorita, which most of the other Pokemon skills are. They only boost themselves, but Chikorita boosts all of your team members, which is fantastic. So, um, special attack, attack, speed. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with what speed does uh, in Pokemon Masters, it doesn't help you regenerate energy faster. No, it doesn't. <laughs> in fact, it just gives you like a, a higher priority chance to attack first. So, let's say for example, uh, under the co-op battles, you know, there's this unity attack. In order to activate it, you need all your party members to attack within the same duration without being um, chain broken by your opponent's attacks. So let's say for example, I have Chikorita attack, then I have Lycan Rock attack, then I have Pidgeot attack. Um, that will cause uh, sync, uh, I would say unity charge. Yeah, so <laughs> um, that's basically what speed is about. It just gives you a priority ch uh, chance to attack faster than your opponents. So if you want to charge up that unity charge bar. Alright, so sharply raises them if the weather is sunny. So, oh, okay. So uh, I guess if you have ability to cause the field to change, um, if it's sunny, that which is I think this thing Pokemon is not affected by status. No, that's not it. So you in the end you still need a Pokemon that actually uh, causes sunny day, um, which causes like a uh, bright gl uh, glaring sunlight to come down to the field. Uh, and when it's around, and of course you use this skill, it boosts the stats uh, greatly instead of its normal amount, which is fantastic. All right. So, I don't know, let's look at the um, finishing move for Chikorita, Grass Sink Beam. So, 240 damage, and of course it uses the special attack stat, no additional effects, so it's basically just pure damage. Okay, Dire Hit All, raises the critical hit rate of all allied sink pairs. So, once again, two wonderful skills on Chikorita, which makes Chikorita a very very important member um, of the support team, just like Rosa's uh, Snivy, if you guys um, still remember her and are still using her. <laughs> she is one of the best uh, grass type trainers that we have uh, available right now in the game, that is Rarity 5, alongside with um, Lyra. All right. So light screen. Uh, light screen uses three energies. Wow. Okay, reduces special damage done to the air light field of play. So once again, another fantastic support skill. Uh, in this time round, this is a defense skill. So if let's say for example your opponent's team uses the special attack stats to do damage to you, uh, light screen is definitely going to be important. And of course. Um, from the looks of it, Chikorita, even though it's only offensive skill, uses 2 energy, you might not be using Chikorita to attack at all. So basically Chikorita is just purely there for the support skills that uh, she has. So let's look at the passive skill, which we accidentally took a look at just now. Solar Shield. The Pokemon is not affected by status conditions whether the weather is sunny. Uh, when the weather is sunny. So the problem is, how do we activate sunny day? <laughs> so I really don't know. Um, hmm, maybe in the future when it evolves to Meganium, uh, it might 
activate or rather learn um, future skills that might cause sunny day. Maybe like when you switch out to Meganium, it automatically uh, activates sunny day, that kind of stuff. So being able to not be affected by status conditions when the weather is sunny, that is godlike. <laughs> you cannot get poisoned, you cannot get paralyzed, you cannot get burned. Uh, there are so many status effects, oh my goodness. Um, this makes Chikorita a very important support player at this point of time. So guys, if you can afford the scout, please get Chikorita. Uh, well, at this point of time that um, Pokemon Masters is out, of course. And maybe in the future, if you're watching this video, like, I don't know, uh, one or two years later, <laughs> after Pokemon Masters launch, there might be better trainers out there with better plant type support or maybe even it may not be plant type it might be um, normal like maybe they release some kind of awesome blissy out there that has like super healing capabilities <laughs> so yeah guys um, but as of this time um, Lyra's Chikorita is definitely a must have so I'm just gonna spend um, 3000 gems just for 10 scout and hopefully we do get her. Of course you can see... Oh! Ah, so apparently the scout points... Oh! Do they expire? Oh, oh no! So each of the scouts have their own specific scout points. So the last video I scouted for blue. So that's why I had 30. Wow! In order to reach 400, that's a lot of scouts. <laughs> Wow, okay. Um, I mean, you can actually get all the trainers, I suppose. Let's see, is Lyra inside this one? Apparently not. Huh. Okay, so Lyra is not in this scout. What about Blue? Okay, she's not here as well. So, yeah. So Lyra is basically on her own, but let's see, who else? Blue is still available in Lyra's, Olivia is also available in Lyra, so I guess Lyra's scout is the best one to go with right now, uh, since she has the other two trainers which has focused scouts. So yeah, um, of course go with the, you know, the most latest scout if you wish to uh, obtain certain trainers. Uh, make sure you, of course, check out you know which trainers are available, and of course, pay attention to their percentage ratings. So yeah, two percent on Lyra. Um, two percent is kind of low still, but you know we've seen games that actually has more generous percentage. But <laughs> guys, that's just mobile games. They're all there to earn money. And of course, they have to have some kind of a scheme in order to leech money off you. So, <laughs> let's dig down to it. We're gonna do a single 3000 gem pool, which is 10 trainers. Hopefully, we do get a 5 star trainer. And of course, hopefully that is Lyra. Um, we still have not seen how Pokemon Masters actually give you like a, um, a kind of like a visual notice that you put a 5 star trainer, I don't know. Let's pay close attention once again. Hopefully we can spot something this time round. Alright, so we got to slide the Pori phone. Okay, so the animation, I don't know, I might compare it to my blue scout. I don't know, let's, let's figure things out. Got Kate. Oh, I have a duper. There we go, so her sync level improves. And duplicate her game as well. Ah, he's new. Okay, she's new as well. Another duplicate. 
Okay. Oh, we got a four star though. Oh. Oh. Okay, so I did not get a five star. I don't know. I have a feeling it's regarding that um, trainer that moves towards the Pokemon Center. That's the one you really need to look for. And of course, if it changes color, it might hint that you've gotten a five star. So, okay. I'm going to use another 3000 gems. I really want Lyra, <laughs> so therefore I'm going to do this again. Now of course you can see the scout points, you know, one one ten pool is uh, 30 scout points. Wow, you have to pull like almost more than 10 times just to get a guaranteed trainer of your choice. You know, ouch, that's really painful in terms of real life money, so... Hmm. <laughs> Here we go, second time. Um, let's pay close attention to the trainer again that comes to the Pokemon Center. Oh no, it's blue in color this time round. Oh no, that's not good. Oh, she's new. Alright, duplicates. Oh, he's new. Hey, Lieutenant Sir. Too bad he's not with his right you. Okay. So I guess the rarest trainer will be the last one. He's new. He's new as well. Ah, uh, okay, so the rarest trainer will be the last trainer to appear. So, four stars. Oh, dang. Okay. Do I, do I want to go for another one? So tempting, oh my goodness. But 3000 gems is really hard to come by in Pokemon Masters. Uh, okay, I'm going for one last one. <laughs> You know, considering that the scouts don't really expire, I guess you could accumulate the amount of um, you know scout points. Then of course, eventually claim the trainer. Oh, it's blue again. Oh no. Okay, she's new. She's new as well. I've got the twin. Yeah, she's old. No, I mean not not age old, but yeah. Uh, you know what I mean. <laughs> so. Okay. Another one. Wow. So, unlike... Um, I guess, unlike Ultime Macross, maybe Pokemon Masters has a time thing situation going on with the gachas or the scouts, where a certain period of time in the day, if you pull scouts, you might get rarer trainers. Oh god, this time I didn't even get a 4 star. Wow, that is really harsh. Uh, okay, I'm gonna spend all my gems just for this video to prove a point, I suppose. I, I don't know. I, I said I wanted to do a single pool and I ended up doing all of it. Oh god. Okay. Let's play close attention again. So I guess blue color trainers are the worst. Oh no, it's another blue one. Duplicate, duplicate, duplicate. Oh, she's new. Oh, she's new as well. Oh, she's a four star. Oh no. Could they appear at any position? Huh. Okay, the detail of her. Oh! Another 4 star! Oh! 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 <laughs> well, she's not Lyra! But, yay! I guess this is the best pool so far. We got 2 4 stars and 1 5. 
Wow! Hmm. Alright, so let's see what does she do. Bite. Oh, she has a... Wait, I have a feeling she has a Mega Evolution? Yeah! Snarl. So it uses a special attack stat as well, lowers the target's special attack. Huh. There's a small chance of making the targets flinch. Dire hit, so it boosts itself. Entertain me. The lower the user's HP is, the more this move raises the user's special attack. Whoa. So, flame proof prevents the Pokemon from getting burned. Okay. Prevents the Pokemon from falling asleep. Okay, so it's a very powerful offensive Pokemon. Hmm. Alright, so yeah, not too sad about it. Become Mega Houndoom until end of battle. So Mega Houndoom, what does the move actually does? No, oh, it's the same thing. Alright, so I don't know. Um, I guess I can play around with uh, Lycan Rock with Houndoom, you know, because um. Lycan Rock uses the att normal attack stat, while Houndoom uses the special attack, which is pretty good with um, Rosa's uh, uh, Snivy, or maybe Superior if you if you evolved it already. Um, I might train her up and replace Lycan Rock, you know, um, because well, Superior actually helps Houndoom better uh, since Superior boosts special attack. Um, so yeah. So anyway guys, thank you guys for joining me on this scout video. Um, hopefully you guys have better luck than I do um, out of... That was how many pools? That was four? Oh wow. <laughs> so hopefully out of four pools or maybe even your first pool might be better than mine. And of course, I wish you guys all the best. Hopefully you guys get Lyra instead. Um, of course, other trainers are acceptable as well. Uh, like blue is pretty awesome uh, of course um, Olivia is awesome as well uh, and then you got Karen which I just got so yeah hopefully you guys get awesome trainers and of course if you guys get Lyra let me know in the comments down below if you do get her and wow that is one awesome trainer to have as a support unit hopefully I will get her in the future and yeah I'll see you guys in the next Pokemon Master Scout video. Until then, bye!